Pest control companies use various methods to get rid of fire ants, including baiting, insecticides, and broadcasting spraying of turf and lawns. Baiting involves placing small bait containing a slow-acting insecticide near the fire ant colony. The ants take the insecticide-impregnated bait back to their colony, where the queen and other workers consume it. This method is effective because it targets the reproductive capabilities of the colony, preventing it from growing and spreading. Drenching involves applying a liquid insecticide directly to the fire ant colony. This method is effective for treating large colonies or colonies that are located in hard-to-reach areas. Broadcasting involves applying an insecticide over a large area to kill fire ants and prevent them from establishing colonies. This method is often used to protect lawns and gardens from fire ant infestations. It is important to note that while these methods can be effective in getting rid of fire ants, they also pose a risk to non-target species such as bees, butterflies, and beneficial insects. Therefore, choosing a pest control company that uses integrated pest management IPM, techniques, which rely on a combination of methods to control pests while minimizing harm to the environment, is essential. In addition, it's always good to consult with professional pest control companies before taking action. They will be able to assess the situation and provide you with the appropriate treatment plan and advice. In summary, pest control companies use a combination of baiting, drenching, and broadcasting to get rid of fire ants. Still, choosing a company that uses integrated pest management techniques to minimize environmental harm is crucial.